Welcome back to this channel for practice problems for actuarial exams. My name is Krzysztof Ostaszewski. You can find information about me at smarturl.it forward slash Jedi. My advice on how to pass actuarial exams is at smarturl.it forward slash pass. I direct the actuarial program at Illinois State University. You can find information about it at smarturl.it forward slash actuary. If you would like to make a tax deductible donation to support our students, at Illinois State University, please go to smarturl.it forward slash help ISU actuary. Here's a problem for today for exam FM on financial mathematics. It is known that 500 invested for two years will yield $175 in interest. Find the accumulated value of a $1,375 invested at the same rate of compound interest at time zero and accumulated for seven years together with 650 invested at the same rate of compound interest at time two years and accumulated to the same end time as the $1,375 investment. Let us write J for the effective rate of interest over two years. So we're switching to two-year period as a unit of time. Uh, then um, J is 175 over 500 or 0.35 or 35,000 based on that's how much interest you earn on $500 in two years. Now seven years contains 3.5 two-year periods so that the accumulated value of $1,375 accumulated over seven years will be 1,375 times 1 plus this interest rate of 35, so 1.35, to the power of 3.5, or approximately $3,930.71, while there are 2.5 two-year periods in five years, so that the accumulated value of $650 will be 650 times 1.35 to the power 2.5, or approximately $1,376.41, and we just add these two amounts, 3,970.71 plus 1,376.41, that total of these two is 5,307.12, and that's answer B. Please remember that this is copyrighted material. The problem comes from me and the solution is mine. So all rights are reserved by me and any reproduction must be agreed to by me in writing. Um, otherwise, I do not agree to any reproduction of this material. Good luck in your studies and good luck on the test.